Hey guys, today I am filming my super, super long overdue Brandy Melville warehouse sale haul. Um, and also please excuse my voice, I might sound a little bit weird just because I have been suffering from a sore throat. The Brandy Melville sale that I went to was in Toronto, it was about two or three weeks ago. Um, depending on when I post this video. Like, all the prices were $20 and under, so the majority of like all the tops were like $5, $10, um, like the bendos were $3. On their Instagram and their Facebook is how I found out about it, and they said it would be $40 and under, but basically everything there was $20 and under. And just to kind of get a, like a general like feel of the warehouse sale for those of you who maybe want to go in the future, it was basically just like a big open conference hall building. Um, and they just had like cardboard boxes in lineups everywhere. If I have a picture, I'll insert it here. Yeah, it was just lines and lines of like cardboard boxes filled with stuff and there, nothing was like in particular order so you had to literally like get down on your knees and like dig through it all to find the good stuff, um, which was kind of inevitable. I figured that's how it would be. Then that's what I was like expecting when I went there, so that's not really a surprise, but just in case you're like thinking it's gonna be like high quality, everything's like laid out and organized, nah. It's not like that. It was kind of like a free-for-all and you had to like get in there and dig, but I picked up some great finds and for really awesome deals considering Pretty Melville, especially in Canada, is like jacked up prices. Um, but I really like their clothes and like how they like sit on like a figure, you know what I mean? Like they just drape nicely. Um, so that's what I like about their, um, a lot of their pieces. So let's go into the haul and of me blabbering and yeah, let's just jump on into it. So the first thing I got was actually this baseball tee and this I believe was $5. Didn't keep the prices nor did I get a receipt. You just pay like cash at the sale. Um, so I don't really remember, but everything that I purchased was $10 or under except for one thing, which I will say. So the next thing I picked up was this maxi skirt and it has this cute sunflower pattern on it. It is kind of sheer, um, just like most of their clothing, so I'll definitely wear shorts underneath it, which I would anyways. It's super cute for layering in the spring and summer. And with that maxi skirt, I picked up this shirt for $5. And it is just this really baggy, um, kind of oatmeal, creamy colored shirt, and it has a pocket right there and I thought it would look really cute paired with the maxi skirt and kind of like tied in a knot and it would look so like boho chic. Um, so I'm super excited to wear that once the warmer weather gets um, gets here because yesterday it was a freaking blizzard in Canada where I live so that's not very nice. Next I got two bandos and these were each three dollars and this first one is just plain black and it has ruching in the middle there. And this one is super soft fabric, let me say that. Um, and it's just a stripey black and white fabric with, again, ruching in the middle. And yeah, both of these were $3, which is a steal. Next, I got a muscle tank for $5. And this is also a super, super soft gray material. It kind of has like a neat stitching down the middle. The next top I got was actually this thing right here. And it is so complicated to hold up to show you guys. Oh, 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 I think I got it, I got it. So this is the front of it, and then this is the back. If you can see that, it is all like cut out here. Here, let me. So it's all these like crisscrossy straps, but I think it'd be good to wear on like a super, super scorching hot day with like a pair of hot high-waisted shorts. And yeah, it's just super cute. <laughs> I'm so ready for summer, can you tell? <laughs> and the sunflower top was $5. I got this black cropped t-shirt, and this was $5 as well. The next thing I got was these shorts, and they were $15. Um, they just looked like that. They're really, really short when I'm showing them to you guys, but I swear when they're on, they're longer, just because they like they scrunch up when they're not on. Um, but yeah, they're just a frayed white denim. It's like Those were the only ones that I had seen in the sale, so snatch those up. The next thing I got was this purple hoodie and it's just like their slouchy hoodies with um, like the really thin fabric but they're good for layering in the summertime with the little tassels here and this one was ten dollars. Um, it kind of reminds me of like a Barney purple. It's super super like bright kind of like magenta-y purple but 
It's super cute and it fits really nicely, so I'm definitely happy with it. And lastly, I picked up another hooded sweater and this one was $10 as well. It's just this gray and black stripey fabric and it actually has little like thumb holes in the bottom. So I've worn this quite a bit. I actually wore this to the Imagine Dragons concert the other day. So that is the end of my Brandy Melville warehouse sale haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and favorite if you liked it. And make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.